Oh, 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 my dear Nigerians, wherever you are in the world, I'm Father Bunny, a Nigerian living here in the United States. I want to join my voice to those of the youth in Nigeria who are actually out there protesting, not just only for the end of SARS, but also the end of bad leadership. People are crying, asking for help because there are many deplorable situations in our nation. The youth cannot get jobs. They are being maligned by a malicious enemy within. The worst enemy you can contend with is the enemy within. This is what is called the insider effect. You can contend with fighting an enemy from outside but the, when the enemy is within it is a very gruesome fight you wouldn't know how you can be overcome by the tactics of the inside enemy so we are calling upon the government to listen to these protesters to hack into their voice every struggle for freedom often comes with revolution we know about the french revolution it began with the fact that the people had no bread. America also got freedom after a revolution. So, we are looking beyond the SARS. SARS becomes a platform that will bring about a newness, something transforming, something that will bring us to that point where we have to enjoy the good benefits God has given to us as a nation. Nigeria is blessed, a country of about or more than 180 million people blessed with human and natural resources. Yet the problem is leadership. Every leader should pay attention to the meaning of being a leader. A leader listens. A leader is empathetic. A leader is affectionate. A leader is diligent. A leader is someone who is effective. And a leader is reliable. And if you lose all these points, there is no point sitting out there. So we are calling upon the president to rise and address this situation. The people here in the United States of America are sympathetic about the situation. They connect with us and they are praying earnestly to the end of SARS and the end of all the brutality from the police. People should have peace in their land. Oh, 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 Oshé, 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 Baba. I'm going to call some of our members here, my friends and parishioners, to address also the nation and the people there in Nigeria, also the youth. Most of them have been killed. So we are asking John to come and address. Just tell them, give them words of support. We all want to wish you liberty and freedom, and we will pray for you. Thank you. Who wants to speak? We pray the Divine Mercy Chaplet every day. She says we're going to be praying for you using the Divine Mercy Chaplet every day. to stop killing the innocent lives in this world. We will pray for everyone. Thank you. That's Ada. You can see they have um, Nigerian names here. There's Ramatu, there's Obi here, there's Ngozi, there's Uche, there's Emen, there's Chichi, there's Fumi, there's Musa. So, we are so happy to join our voices with the youth there and we pray that uh, this situation will become better. We want something that will come out from this. We also in, enjoin the youth not to be violent. There is no point being violent at this point in time. You can make your point. 
you can protest peacefully and God will also lead us to that promised land we are looking out for. Oshé Baba, Oshé, 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 Oshé Baba, Oshé, 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 Oshé Baba, Oshé, 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 Oshé Baba, Oshé, Oshé, Oshé. Oshé Baba, Oshé, 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 Oshé Baba.